What's up, you guys? So, as you can see, Nova decided today was the day of it's her It's go day. time. <laughs> what time is it, babe? It's go time, man. It's go time. Let Finally them know here. what's up. Five in the morning. <laughs> <sighs> so, I guess I can kind of tell you guys what's kind of going on. I need to talk a little loud because her, her like, I'm like all hooked up to the monitors and stuff and you can hear her heartbeat. Okay, so Dimitri and I fell asleep on the couch last night watching a movie and 2.30 in the morning I wake up because I literally feel like I'm peeing on myself. <laughs> I like wake Dim up. I'm like, oh my God, is this, what is this? I'm like peeing on the couch right now and I go to the bathroom feels like I just use the restroom or whatever and then I come out of the restroom and it's just like, more coming out and I'm just like what is this like I'm leaking this is a lot of leakage you know it keeps leaking so I'm like okay babe let's just go to bed let's look let's go lay down I don't know like what this is like, but like stuff is really just like leaking out okay so I try to get into bed and just like another puddle in the bed and I'm just like okay what is this like I'm like this is not normal this is doesn't feel like regular leakage so it continues on it hits about three o'clock and I'm just like it's still happening it's getting worse at this point like no pain but it's getting worse as far as like the leakage goes so I'm like you know what like Demetrius googling all kind of stuff just trying to figure it out like well people say it's this people say this happens all the time I'm like no babe this literally feels like way more than what these people are talking about so I called the labor and delivery line and they definitely advised me to go to the hospital so here we are at the hospital it's game time well not really literally yet but um, I'm hooked up to the machines and did all the paperwork and um, they checked me did a little swab test to see if it was my water that broke and it definitely was so here we are guys, the start of my labor and delivery video. So, hope you guys are ready and excited because I don't know if we're ready. <laughs> ready. Oh, Dem said he's been ready, so there's that. We obviously have not gotten any sleep, so we're really tired. It's about almost 5.15 right now. Um, so honestly, I'm gonna try to sleep as much as I can. They also said that they're probably going to induce me um, because when your water breaks and then you, you're not going immediately into labor, they usually will induce you. So until that happens and until the midwife comes in and speaks to us, I'm going to try to go to sleep. That's what's happening right now, guys. So just keep watching and uh, I'll let y'all keep y'all updated. Feel it in your hand? Yes. You're going to feel some pressure, okay? Okay, you're going to feel some cold fluid go up your arm. First IV, <laughs> look at that.
You're still standing. Right. right. Try to throw my support somehow. <laughs> Look at him being strong for you. <laughs> So, last time you seen me, we were waiting on the nurse to come in and kind of tell us some stuff, and it's been about, um, you guys seen me, I think I had the camera last on at like five, it is now... It is now 7.51, so it's been a good few hours. We've been sleeping um, at 7.30. They just started up my, um, what is it? I can't remember the, the drug it is, but either way, they basically put my IV and stuff in and plugged it all up. So they put my IV and stuff in to go ahead and... Um, get going on inducing me um into labor so pretty much what's happening now is i'm just chilling still um like i said we were asleep so they kind of want me to keep chilling until um you know my contractions get heavier and all that good stuff so what the what the what the medicine will do is um what the medicine is going to do is basically kickstart my contractions and make them more frequently as well as help me dilate more because when they checked me around five I was only two and a half centimeters which is fine which isn't bad um but now they said because I was I am ruptured which means I think that means referring to my water being broken um that I'm more liable for infection so they have like a certain time frame so which is why at 730 they started me up with going ahead and inducing me so yeah I'm just chilling here hungry but I can't eat anything anymore so now that they started me on this medicine so kind of want to go back to sleep um until this pain kicks in because your girl's tired. Like I said, we've been up since two o'clock. So as you see, Demetria is knocked. So <sighs> it's just super uncomfortable to lay on this bed. I'm not even gonna lie. But yeah, I kind of want to sleep to take my mind off things so that I'm not freaking out. I wish my hair was washed, <coughs> but, but yeah, we're just chilling and it's just waiting game really, so you guys will know when it's game time. I'm actually kind of already feeling some pain, so, but I feel like it's just kind of like my back hurting because it's, it's like so uncomfortable to even lay, lay down, so I don't know, but either way, she said that, um, Whenever I'm feeling super pain and all that good stuff, I can go ahead and like ask her for my epidural or whatever. So, yes, I'm doing epidural. So, yeah, I'll just keep updating you guys. That's what it means. So how are you feeling? You look pretty feel, drugged up. I feel so lit. <laughs> um, they just gave me some type of IV medicine because, like, my contractions have started. And so... So, yeah, last time you left off, you were saying how you felt drunk. 
Mm-hmm. One second, I'm having a little contraction. Oh, we should do this. This looks cool. It's a shadow box with infinite. Inf I can't talk. <laughs> I definitely want to do a shadow box. Um, but Hang yeah. that bitch up in her room. That's super cute. Um, but yeah, guys. Um, so like 15 minutes ago, I was in lots of pain. <laughs> um, the contractions were definitely like coming, and they were coming back to back. Um, but they gave me some IV medicine, so if I look a little thrown, that's why. <laughs> She told me it's going to feel like I just drank a whole fish bowl, and that's definitely what it feels like. Um, but other than that, we're just kind of like, I don't know. Am I making sense? <laughs> I mean, yeah. Okay. But this medicine has definitely helped. Like, I, like the contractions were kind of like... Like I can now I can talk through my contraction, but before they gave me the medicine, they were they were like I had to like stop. Well, technically that's a lie because you had to stop before this video started. Or well, during this video. only a little bit, not as bad as the before. Like they're definitely a lot better. Like they saw I was having a contraction, I didn't realize I was having a contraction because. And they can see the contractions on here. Yes, you can. This is oh. What's wrong, baby? I stepped on one of your cords. Um. But this chart right here shows like the amount of the contractions. So you see, she just had like a back to back one. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then this is Nova's heart rate, I believe. Um, something like that. Don't quote me on this. I'm just here for the ride. Either way. But um, yeah, guys, it literally feels like when I'm having a contraction. Like she's coming through, like she's gonna come out my butt. Hello. Hi. Two to three, still big, minus two. That's how you're about the same. Okay. okay. Do they feel more intense now with the Pitocin? Okay. Yes. Did that second dose of fentanyl help? Um, it helped, and then right when you walked in, that's when I started. I'm good. You're welcome. So <laughs> feel them. Well, that's when I started. Hey there, my little pumpkin. She, she, you know, she a little tired now. We had a little scare going on for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Nova wasn't having it, y'all. Nova wasn't having it, man. <laughs> Jasmine tried to get up, and she wasn't with it. Started grabbing on the cord. Her heart uh, race dropped. Dramatic, drastic. Dropped hard. And Very scary, guys. I had to step out. So that's the first thing I hear. So, you know. But everything's good. Um, she just got her epidural shot. Y'all want to see that? No, y'all might see her ass. It's crazy, guys, because it's making me feel really nauseous. But apparently that's normal. So yeah. Just trying to... Throwing up is good is what they said. Probably going to use this time to get some rest. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. But, uh, your girl... Been starving, but she can't eat. Yeah, I'm hungry too. I just wanna get some Chick Fil A till y'all call me back. <laughs> so. Okay, babe. All right, y'all. <laughs> okay, guys. Hour 14, and it's a lot of a lot of nonsense going on. Nova is not liking this penicillin still. Well, she wasn't, but I think she is now. I think she is now. Yes. They uh. Um. Still shaking. Um, but basically what's been happening is they have been uh, monitoring her heartbeat. And um, sometimes she doesn't like the contractions. So if the penicillin is up too high and she's not used to it, her heartbeat drops. And so they like came in and was like, we're going to have to do a C-section. And... I just, you guys, I don't want to do a C-section, so I just, I really, really want to have a vaginal birth and push her out, so, but, um, luckily they're giving it another go-round, so 
because she got used to the six after the second time around. So hopefully she gets used to the eight this second time around. So I don't know. But, and now I have a temperature of 102, which is technically not a fever until it hits 104. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on. Just monitoring me. I keep throwing up, so there's that. <laughs> but I'm in no pain, so I'd rather take all of this than be in excruciating pain. So I hope you guys can understand me because I'm shaking. So. <laughs> Anything I missed, moms? <laughs> temperature is 100.2. That's what I said. Oh, 100. Oh, my bad. 100.2, not 102. 100.2. I'm tripping because once you said 100.2, in my head I said 102. That's great. What you said? My mom said, <laughs> tell them you're having contractions off the chain. <laughs> so the contractions are off the chain, y'all, and Nova's handling them. So she's being a good girl in there. She's she being strong, so. Yeah, I know it looks like I'm in like excruciating pain, but I just have like no energy. I haven't eaten. I'm starving. Like I'm literally starving. I could really use a Subway sandwich or some pizza. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna get. Oh, actually, some hibachi sounds. <laughs> okay, I'm doing the most. Yeah, I'm doing the most. How about a salad? When you breastfeed, you can't give no y'all. How about a salad? <laughs> Salad. Oh, he's right because this eating lifestyle is going to change. Auntie Nessa will bring you a salad. <laughs> I want no salad. Exactly. Hour 12, go watch. No, yeah, 12, go watch. 14. 14? 14. Yeah, 14. 14. Oh, I'm drunk. I mean, not really. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's just what I say when I like am tripping. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And it's funny. Oh yeah, and another thing is like my heart rate sometimes was earlier had kept dropping. Yours or Nova's? The babies. Both. I mean my and then your my blood, blood pressure. pressure. Oh, it was. My blood pressure oh, yeah. was dropping. Yes, really, yes. Really low. Sorry, y'all. I'm off them dreads. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> my blood pressure was dropping. I thought it said oxycontin at first. I was Me like, too. when I first walked in, I said oxycontin. I said, oh, oxycontin. Ooh. I was like, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> look, turn it good. good. Exactly. Can't even, oh, there I go. Mm -hmm. So, you want me to do it? Hey, man. You said cover my head. Oh, shoot. What? Appreciate it. So, um, bad news YouTube. Gotta do a C section. Nova just wasn't with the uh, medicine. What did they give you? It's called uh, Pitocin. Pitocin. So, I can't even find myself in this. Oh, there I go. Um, but yeah, Nova was not reacting good about that at all. So doctors recommended a C-section. So we're getting ready as you see. Forty got my C-section fit. So we uh. Oh shoot! That's a touchdown. Hey, I'm sorry, YouTube. I'm getting distracted. You know, it was Wild Card Weekend. A lot of stuff going on this weekend. We're almost there, all right? So quiet. <laughs> I've been making a peep now.
Chibi get the things and go. I know, we love so much, we almost need a hair dryer. Oh my goodness. Baby, nobody's yeah, here. I don't trust the fuck with this one. We were 12 here, I'm not that So we got some family so here, guys. Yeah, we are. Watching the Falcons yeah, game. Last minute. Is that Everyone's just enjoying, enjoying exactly. Baby Nova. You should know that from us. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not talking about that ever again. Mm -hmm. Come on, y'all. There we go. Hi guys, so as you see my family and stuff is here and we are basically just really embracing Nova. C-section went really well, um, no complications or anything like that. Now I'm just like really tired and I haven't eaten anything and I can't eat until like the morning time, so, so sometime around there. But um, I like looking at myself. I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, so... Nova is so she here and she it's just really oh, emotional and exciting okay. and you a clip. It didn't make sense here. Yeah, <laughs> make a shadow box for her. I'll put this in. I said, who flip phone that is? <laughs> this that is your Uncle Davey. He's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I said, don't talk to him. So I ain't know they had cameras on us. You trying to flip phone. You trying to make fun of somebody. You just had a flip phone yesterday. I ain't know who flip phone. I didn't know they had cameras on Oh, 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 you were holding that early. I was about to say, what was just sitting here. Oh, that was funny. I'm okay. I need to get the lighting over there. Or come up here. Are you scared to stand up? I ain't seen that one. I knew. Look at this. That's a new one right now. I'm going to be one of the new generation. The new generation of flip phones. She ain't even facing Nova. Chill. I ain't got time for that. It looked dirty. Right. Right. That thing was. We ain't trying to aim it. We ain't trying to aim it. Nobody boo. Chill with that. She looks like you. Chill with all that. She does. 100%. She looks like Jasmine. She looks like you. She looks like you. She looks like you. Hello, everyone, and welcome to day two of my labor and delivery life as of right now. We are up in Adam. It's noon, but we've been up all all day, pretty much all morning, all night. Um, but my mom and my sister just got here, um, so we are we are just uh, chilling. They brought me some lunch. This is like a chicken sandwich and some mashed potatoes and some fruit. Look at these cute cups my sister got. My sister and my mom got. So cute. I love it so much. But anyways, so today, this morning, they got me up out of the bed because, as you know, I, I ended up having to have a C-section. So um, they had me get up out the bed today and walk around and kind of clean myself up and be able to like mm -hmm. to function better so i was able to brush my teeth and brush my hair back as best as i could so um that's kind of what's going on right now so i'm definitely expecting but I think people she's more alert because she she's heard the voices before yeah so. yeah I'm definitely expecting people right to now. be coming through within the next like 15 minutes. Um, but my mommy and my sister are here right now. Say hi guys. Hey. Mommy's loving on Nova. I haven't made a video of Nova yet. I haven't shown them. I'm cleaning up producer. I mean, will you show my iPhone videos? Oh yeah, I could put those in there. Um... So yeah, guys, um, we're just chilling. Vanessa got me some really cute, Vanessa and my mom got me some really cute decorations for the room and for the door. So I'll have, um, I'll have somebody pan that for you guys so you can see it. But we're just chilling, relaxing. The doctor said I did really good with getting up today. And, um, you know, when, when you have a C-section, there's just extra caution measures you have to take um, and kind of things that you have to worry about as far as, like, passing gas and just 
things like that so um, making sure there's no leakage on my incision and making sure that my um, pain levels are uh, tolerable so um, someone is always coming to check on Nova and I Nova is doing amazing as well every time they go check her she's good she's a healthy happy beautiful baby so yeah Okay, it's been a long, long, long day. I've just been experiencing a lot of pain, and they've taken me off of like my um, like epidural. It wasn't the epidural; like the epidural was still in my back, um, but they were like filling me with other medicines that were helping with my incision pains. Um, so, but they have, they weaned me off of those. It was like the beginning of the day started out really great and really strong. I was, I was, I was really strong and, you know, moving around was, was good and I had no problems. Um, okay guys, sorry for the scene change. Uh, my nurse just came in and we had to like take my tape off and all that stuff so but like I was saying um it's just been an overwhelming day I've been I think like I just kind of had like a mental breakdown a second ago just because like I'm just so tired and I'm just like Nova's just kind of acting a little bit like just been really fussy and it's kind of like no matter what you do, she's just like upset. And the only place she wants to be is on my nipple. I don't know if it's because she's cluster eating right now and she just wants to eat a whole lot. And then with minimal breaks. So I don't know if that's kind of what's going on. But and then also like Dim's kind of been gone all day. Like not that like it that made a difference, but... For my psyche, it's just kind of like, I just want him here. But, and so, you know, when he got back, it just, like, Novi still was just acting crazy. So it just, I don't know. And then on top of that, I'm on a lot of pain. So it's just like, I just need a lot of rest. So we're going to take advantage of the nurse, of the nursery tonight. And have Nova go to the nursery so we can get rest. Uh, Cause we didn't really get much rest last night, um, and so that way we don't go completely insane. Because once I start breaking down and crying and things, is how I know it's just like okay, I need to relax, get it together. But a lot of people came by today to hang out. So like I said, for the most part, the beginning of the day has been good. Um, But you know, once it once it started winding down, 
and the pain started really kicking in. Like they had me on Percocets, but they really not doing anything, which is annoying me because I can only take them every four hours. Like this ain't no regular Tylenol. So like, I'm not understanding, but I finally hit 24 hour mark so I can take a shower. But because the pain is so much, I probably will be taking my shower in the morning. Um, so yeah, babe, did you miss Nova today while you were gone? Mm -hmm. And you. And me, you missed me too. I missed you too. It's been a long day. So, anyways, this is my labor and delivery story. Two day special, you know what I'm saying? Didn't just give you guys a labor and delivery, kind of gave you guys some postpartum stuff as well. So. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I know I look out of it. I'm just extremely tired. So, yeah. So, um, happy, healthy babies. That's all I can really ask for at the end of the day. And this is all just a different experience and the wish than one that I, you know, anticipated and planned for. So, but it's okay. Everything was done in God's will and his plan. So, and at the end of the day, we made a perfect little girl. So, Yep. Well, thank you guys for watching. And if you did like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up per usual. And stay tuned for more videos with Baby Nova in them. <laughs> We're so excited. Uh, yeah, so I'll catch you guys in my next one.